welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're really just gonna kick it off and do the try on. If you watched my last video, my vlog, you know that I was packing for my trip. And now I'm gonna be showing you guys the clothes and outfits that I put together for the trip. So if you guys wanna see what I am packing and what I am wearing, then just keep watching. So this is the first outfit. I am obsessed. Now, if you watched my vlog, you would know that this was not in the video because I completely forgot about it. And I had it hanging in my closet because I was trying to like pair it with stuff. And I completely forgot to put it in the video. And this is like one of my favorite outfits. So here it is. Um, so actually this tank top right here, oh, it's like, like a crop tank top is from Forever 21. I did just pick it up because I needed um, just a good white one. Um, and then, Honestly, I don't know if I'm liking it with this outfit. I think because I had a vision of just like a cute white, like lacy bralette, I was thinking that would be cuter. This is just a little plain. I don't know, you guys let me know. Um, and then I did pair it with like this little vest, kind of like ribbed. It is cropped and it came with like this cute little tie that I just tied around my waist. And it does cross over in the middle, so I just took the two strings and crossed it over and around. And then this is the back. And I thought this was really cute. Um, these pants, did I mention I got this top in a size small and it's from Zara. It was on their like huge sale that they're having right now. So I really don't know if any of this is gonna be available, but if it is, I will definitely link everything for you guys, don't worry. Um, and then I got these like baby pink pants also from Zara. I'm loving these and how they fit. Um, they're really silky soft and I got these in an extra small and they do go like a little wide at the bottom, which I thought was cute. They're really comfortable and I feel like they look really good. I did just pair it with all white Air Forces and I am going for more of like a colorful yet casual look for this trip. I didn't wanna be too dressy. Um, not during the day. So I do have like my dressier night outfits that I'm gonna be packing, um, but that is just stuff that I already have. So I kind of wanted to just save that for, you know, pictures on Instagram and, and whatever. But for the day, I'm gonna be in most of the time on the trip. So that's why I was like, whatever. So yeah, but I am obsessed with this all pink outfit. I think it's so cute. I was honestly not even thinking to pair these two together because they're both pink. And normally I don't go for that type of look, but I was like, you know what? Let me be a little different and outside of the box, um, outside of my comfort zone and let's do an all pink look. Why not? So yeah, I am loving this outfit. Let me know if you guys love it too. Okay, so I remember in uh, my vlog showing this outfit, I was like, some people are gonna be like very iffy about it and others might really like it. So this is outfit number two. First of all, something definitely out of my comfort zone because normally I won't wear jeans with like an oversized shirt. I'll normally wear this with like leggings um, because I feel like very boxy in this, but then I also feel like it looks very like trendy and like what everyone's wearing. This shirt I did get from Marshalls, it was like $8. And then these jeans are from Zara. So let me show them a little better. They're so freaking cute. I'm obsessed with like that detail. And like I said, these actually come out as like shorts, which is kind of weird, but when you put them on, obviously they go back in. And then, I don't know, they're just like so cool to me. And then I did get these in a size 32. So that's a US zero. Um, and these were only $25.99, which is so good. They were a part of the sale also for Zara. Um, and they fit really well around the waist. I will say they're like a stiffer kind of jean um, or denim material. They're just not like the, I don't know. They're like very comfortable around my legs, but when it comes to like around here and like my waist area, not that they're too small, just that they're very stiff. So maybe as I wear them throughout the day, they'll kind of loosen up and stretch out a bit. But otherwise, I still really like them and I think they're just so different and cute. Um, and then this shirt, I just wanted to pair with it because it does say Wild West and I feel like these jeans are totally Wild West. Like it goes, it just goes. Um, and then I paired it with White Air Forces again. Now, something that I'm gonna have like an issue with is shoes on the trip because I don't wanna bring too many 
because of like the weight of my suitcase. Um, so I feel like the Air Forces just literally go with everything. And, but I also just don't want to wear them too much. I don't know. We'll see. I'll just try to pack like at least two or three pairs of sneakers and like keep it at a minimum. Um, but yeah. And then also with this outfit, I was thinking of like tucking the shirt in all the way around because I don't want it to be like too baggy. I don't know. So picture it if I was like tucking it in, would that look better? Or is it just kind of like a look if it's like slouchy? I don't know. You guys let me know. This is definitely out of my comfort zone, but I thought it was really cool and different. So that is outfit number two. Okay guys, so this is the next outfit. This is the same jeans and everything, um, except the shoes actually. So I just changed the top because I wanted to style these a little differently, um, just to show you guys kind of other ways that you can wear them. So I did pair it with this really cute um, like racer back tank top from Garage. So if you did watch my last video of my vlog, you would you would have seen it. But I love it because it has like this under boob like detail. It's just a seam. It's not like a wire or anything. And I love how it fits. It comes like kind of curved down here. Yes, I have all the kids home with me today. So bear with me. Um, and then paired it with the same jeans. And I was too lazy to tie my shoes. But they're just um, Air Force pixels. So that is just another way to style these jeans. And I thought it was a lot more kind of like laid back but cute. And yeah, I love it. I did get this top in a size extra small. So so this outfit I think is probably my favorite. I am just obsessed with the colors. Um, but let's start with the top. So this top I did get in a size small from Zara. I love this ruffle detail. I think it's just so cute it adds so much on just a plain white crop top and then also as well it comes with this string that is also so cute and i just love that it just makes the top so different um and then it is like a ribbed material which i love and you can kind of see my bra i probably won't wear this one um when i actually wear the top but this is a size small and it was $15.99 um, from zara from the sale so i thought that was a great deal and then I just paired it with these really cute lime green pants. I'm trying to keep the camera like in the mirror because I keep stepping back and I feel like you can see like everything, but I am obsessed with the pants. They're just so, so cute to me. They're like a linen material and I love how wide they are at the bottom and everything. And I'm just obsessed with this look. These pants I did get in a size extra small and they have like a little clasp kind of, um, a little clasp thingy i love those because they're just so easy and then it has a zipper and they fit really well besides the waist is just a little bit big which is why i put the tie over it because it kind of helps keep it there otherwise they feel like they're falling down and i hate that feeling um but then yeah this is the back and i just think they're so cute the pants really make this outfit and i mean the top does as well the top is also a staple piece and i am just very much obsessed with this outfit okay guys so this is the next outfit i don't know if you can tell i have like a green thing going on right now i am obsessed with green um but this top is so freaking cute it's just a rib material and it is definitely more green in person than it's showing on camera but i got this from cotton on for literally you guys will not believe three dollars three dollars like how it was on clearance um because one of the cotton ons that I went to at a mall was going out of business and so everything was marked down and I was like wow that is insane so had to pick it up and I think I got this in a size extra small you can definitely wear this just like buttoned how I have it and like open and more you know a little risque or you can unbutton it leave it open and put like a cute bralette or a crop top or just something like that I feel like that would be really cute too but you can definitely just wear it so many different ways. You can also button it like this and put like, you know, a lacy bralette or something underneath. I just have a regular bra on and you kind of can see it like poking through. So I would probably change that. But either way, I still love it. And then I do have it paired with these black denim shorts. These are also from Cotton On. These were only $5, okay? Isn't that crazy? Like, I'm so happy I was there when they were going out of business because I got everything for so cheap. And then I just have it paired with these black sandals don't mind my legs i need to do a tan before we go but i feel like i would just wear it like this like very casual and cute but yeah i'm obsessed oh and these shorts i did get in a size oh my goodness what size are these 
These are a US 4, so they fit really well. They're really comfortable. And I like how it has like this kind of roll right here. You can't unroll it because the seam is stitched, but I think they're really cute and they're the perfect length. These are the mom short high rise. And these are like the only kind that I wear because they're not like too short, but they're also not super long. So I do love that about these. And sorry for my shaky hand. But yeah, this was the next outfit and I think it's so cute. Okay guys, so this is the next outfit. I really like this. It's just very, very casual compared to the other outfits that I've been trying on. But this is the top that I got from Garage. I really, really like it. I knew I was gonna like it on more than like on the hanger because it has like this cute rouging and I feel like it fits really, really good. So I love that it has like a cute collar. Um, it just makes it different as a halter neck. And then it's got like these buttons going down and you can actually unbutton them if you wanted to. I'm not sure why you would want to, but whatever. Um, and it is pretty cropped. It reaches right about to where my jeans are. And then this is the back. I'm just wearing a strapless bra with it because I feel like that's how it fits best. And I actually really like it. I think it's so cute. I did get this in a size extra small. So it was only like $10 too, because they're also having a huge sale. And then I got these shorts from Zara. Um, these are the high rise mom as well. So these you can actually unroll or roll just depending on your style and just like what you're going for. Um, I typically like for my shorts to be rolled um, just because I have like very skinny legs, which I hate, but whatever. Um, so I feel like it just kind of gives more. If they're longer, my legs look like chicken legs. And these I did get in a size zero, which is a 32 at Zara, and they fit amazing. So this is them, great length, obsessed. Honestly, got lazy with the shoes because I don't even know what shoes I would wear with this. I have to go through probably my white Air Forces, right? I mean, why not? They go with everything else. With this, I feel like it's so annoying because <laughs> whenever I tried these on in the store, they were super tight, but I was like, maybe it's because I had just eaten. It's the morning time and I haven't had anything to eat and they actually fit perfect. So I don't know. Does that, does that happen to anyone else? So this is the next outfit. I kept the same shorts on. I don't know if I told you guys these were $20. Oh no, they weren't. They were $15.99. <laughs> just kidding. I had higher hopes for this bodysuit because I don't know. It just is not fitting how I was thinking. This comes way farther down than I thought. Um, and you can really see my bra. Now, there's no way I'm going without a bra with anything. So, like, if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. But you can, like, see my bra right here. And it's kind of annoying. And every time I pull it up, it just goes back down. But it does look really cute. So I'm kind of upset that it's not working. I don't know. Maybe it's not that big of a deal. But it is to me. I don't know. I think I'm just, like, being really picky about it. But... Maybe if I put some of like that boob tape right here to stick it to my bra, I feel like that would actually help. I don't know. But I did get this in a size small and it was from Zara and it was $12.99, so not bad at all. All right guys, so next outfit is this top from Garage. It is a super bright red and it's definitely showing on camera. I love, love, love this color. Um, I do love how it has like that cute cutout on the shoulder and then the neck comes pretty far up and it is a little tight but it doesn't bother me if you are one of those people where stuff like around your neck bothers you do not do not even try because it's definitely like hugging my neck so just something to keep in mind um but it is super cropped and it is kind of like i keep getting a call sorry um it is like a like a workout top material if that makes any sense um, super stretchy, very soft, and just a really good material. Um, and then this is the back. And um, did I say I got it from Garage? It was only like $10. And I was like, that is so cute. They also had it in like a lavender purple, a white, a black, I think a blue. They had a bunch of colors, but I am really liking this red. Um, and then I just have it paired with these leggings. Um, they're like a spandex material. These are from Zara. These were only $10. And then they do have like this mesh on the side, which, okay, when I saw them like in the store, I thought they were cuter than when 
they are like on me. I don't know. I'm not liking them to be honest. Um, they are really comfortable and stretchy, but I think the mesh is a little too much for me. It's like, I don't know. It's giving like, I don't know. It's not all the way around. It does cover up in the back and they fit really well, but I don't know what it is. I think these are going to be returned and I'm happy that I'm trying everything on before the trip because like if I put these on when we were there, I would kind of be upset because I don't love them, but maybe you guys will. Um, I got these in a size small and maybe if they had an extra small, I would like them better because they're just not very, like they're loose right in here and I don't like that, but hey, I mean, either way, I think that someone else could definitely pull these off because like I said, I think they're cute, just not on me. I'm just not feeling it. Um, but yeah, so this is the next outfit. All right, guys, so this is going to be the last outfit. This is just a really cute ribbed crop top from Zara. Um, I did get this in a size small. I do love, love, love this cutout on the side. And like I said, I'm a sucker for one shoulder tops and just basics that are not so basic. Um, now, this top was only $5.99, you guys. When I saw that at Zara, I'm like, how? Such good deals right now. You guys definitely need to go. And then, oh, it is in like a sagey green color, which I really like. It's not like a true olive. It's got like a little bit of like a sagey greeny like teal, a very, very dark teal, but I'm loving it. And then I did pair it with these shorts. I got these shorts at Cotton On. These were also $5, which is insane. Um from the same cotton on that was closing down. So just really good deals. And I am in need of shorts so bad. So I was really happy to pick these up. These are in like a creamy oatmeal color and I just love the color. They're just so different and I don't have anything like these. And then I love like the frayed edges down here. I just think it gives like a little something and I think that's so cute on shorts. So honestly, don't know what shoes to pair with this either. It's just more of a casual outfit. Honestly, don't even know if this is going to be an outfit that I bring on the trip. Um, since this is my first time trying everything on, I'm just kind of going back through the stuff because like the leggings are going back. Um, that other green bodysuit is going to go back and maybe I can just swap it out for something else that I will be wearing on the trip. So I don't know. We'll just have to see about that. But these I did also get in a US 2. Um, and they fit really well, even though they don't roll at the bottom, they're still a pretty good length. So I do like that. And I cannot wait to do my tan because it will just look so much better. But I love that they're not super short. They're like a really good, you know, mom length. So perfect for if you don't want something too crazy short, um, but also not really long and like old lady style, you know, but yeah, so that is the last outfit. Okay guys, so that does conclude today's video. I hope that you guys liked everything that I picked for the trip. Although some of it I did say will be going back, but for the most part, I hope that you guys did like these outfits and comment down below which one was your favorite. I definitely know which one my favorite is. I already said it, whatever. But yeah, you guys let me know what you guys think too. And the next video will be a vlog. Like I said, um, it will be Thursday. So Thursdays are vlog days and I want to have a vlog ready for when we're going to Puerto Rico and when we're, um, you know, like getting on the plane and everything and just getting ready to leave and probably our first day there. So the vlogs for the next couple ones are going to be Puerto Rico trip. Um, and I want to kind of break them up into like day one, day two, day three, day four. So that way it can be spread out throughout the next few weeks. But yeah, so I hope that you guys are excited for the next couple vlogs coming soon. And also stay tuned for another try on haul. Um, try on hauls are my absolute favorite to film. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video.